Hello boys and girls, welcome to my channel, I'm the Obscurian JOPD and for today what we do have in here, and I'm sorry for being a little bit late, it is a Far Cry New Dawn. So Far Cry New Dawn it is developed by Ubisoft Montreal and it is still using the Uni engine, the same engine behind uh, Far Cry 5. Now it seems to be a little bit less demanding than Fair Cry 5, but still on the same league, alright? So don't expect the performance to improve uh, that much. Uh, to be honest, it's quite the same. So I'm running the game with 720p, absolutely minimum settings in here, you can't go below of this. And also 0 0.5 of resolution scaling, which is 50% of resolution scaling. This means that you will be playing the game at around 360p resolution. So this is the minimum requirements, the game asks for an E5-2400 Quokadet 3.1, 8GB of RAM and the GTX 670 of desktop. So our graphic card it is currently much, much more weaker and with the settings that you saw what I got was an average of 31 frames per second and a 1% low of 19 so you can clearly see that the game performance it is something around 20 to 40 frames per second so being an FPS game a shooter game this might be a little bit complicated for some people so you really need to think in order to, if you want to play the game like this or not also not to mention that with these settings, this game looks really bad. You can see pixels all over the place, so it's really bad. You can use TAA if you want, the performance penalty it's hardly noticeable, but you will see that the game will be very, very blurry. So yeah, it's not perfect. Just like Far Cry 5, I do recommend you for playing this game on another PC. And also the wall settings looks pretty good in my opinion, but the resolution that we are actually playing, it is really bad, not even to talk about the frame rates. So if you can play this game on a console or on a slightly more power powerful PC or if you can wait until you can upgrade, go ahead because uh, yeah, Far Cry New Dawn, it is uh, kind of reskin of Far Cry 5. It seems really nice in my opinion, but still it is not essential. Talking about not essential, Ubisoft really understands that and they ask around 45 euros for this game on Steam or Uplay. But in case you want to buy it cheaper, you can get through Kingwin for around 25 euros, which is a discount of 20 euros comparing to Steam or Uplay. Uh, yes, you can activate the game on Uplay with uh, 20 euros more cheaper than buying through Uplay. So, if you want to buy through there with a big discount, just go to the description of the video and you will get the game much more cheaper than you can actually buy on Steam or, or Uplay. But that's really up to you. So I think that's all that I want to talk about Far Cry New Dawn. There isn't too much to talk about, you know the performance already. Uh, I will give you a big big gameplay that sh uh, will help you to understand a little bit the world. Uh, like I said, the performance is between 20 to 40 frames per second. It's more in line with Far Cry 5, so if you played Far Cry 5 in this laptop, you will be able to play Far Cry New Dawn. The performance is pretty much the same, sometimes even more lightweight. So yeah, like I said, that's all. Hope you keep enjoying the rest of the video, and I do hope to see you soon. Goodbye.
have Rush locked up underground. Get in any way you can, and bring him home. Good luck, Cap. Hey, Cap. Finding the highway men is no walk in the park. If you ever find yourself outgunned, you can craft better weapons with the resources you find in Hope County. And remember, the folks in Prosperity are here to help in any way they can. We won't let you down. I thought you were dead. I should have known you'd come through. You came back for me. 
You crazy son of a bitch. She came back for me. We need to go. Now. Let's get going. And the turret. I'll get us out of here. Let's go! Go, go, go! Spotted one! 